Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Saints Row 2. More Sunday missions here, because we want to take out the uh, Lower Dust Gang first. This is a, that is a very, very much this is very much an in joke that Shondi has thousands of exes. That's one of the um, in gags about this game that Shondi has hundreds of exes. Shondi's gonna, Shondi's gonna do a bunch of drugs while we go and blow some people up. So let's um, arm ourselves with our, our newly stocked up machine guns. I'm gonna go out and buy shepherd, buy shepherd handguns uh, as soon as we make some money again. Because I spent all of our money on ammo because money seriously is very easy to come by in this game. You get like two or three thousand for a mission, and um, you can just do one or two missions quickly, just off camera, and make up the money that you spent. So, and and bullets are very very much needed in this. So you do definitely need to be armed. You can't be doing like I was in that mission, in that veteran child kill mission, relying on stealing other people's guns. Well, I mean you can, but it's so much easier knowing you can go in. Fully stocked up, armed, you know, with more armed like Rambo, you know, and know that you're alright to do it rather than having to frugally pick bullets up off the floor like John McClane in Die Hard, you know. Let's park our Saints car there and walk. Time to kill people! I let myself get blown to shit. That was a slight mistake, but hopefully the cutscene, the uh, hopefully the checkpoint will allow me to go back in. And this time I'm going to be a lot more, a lot more open with how I'm clearing people out by actually killing them rather than letting them shoot. Stay in here instead of this. Alternatively, I could just die again. Um, so let's try that again. I'll get this right in a minute. I'm still wielding, so. Gonna blow up. The, I should stay pretty far back. I'm on fire again, dude. Put the flames out. I'm gonna duck for. I'm gonna crouch down for a bit and let my health regain. At least until I get to my car. Now then, we'll drive. Let's drive to the next one. Health should be able to regen mostly by the time we get there. Yeah, health is completely regen. Which is always good! So I'm gonna pull up here. And make my way inside. Right. 
So my target is actually on the upper floor. So I'm looking for a, a staircase. Or a ladder of some sort so I can climb up. Easy staircase, so let's work and make, make our way up the staircase. There's a lot of guards in here, so. Make sure you're careful not to get killed and shoot from a distance so you don't get caught up in crossfire. Head to the final location, so there's only the one table in this building. So work your way back out front, boot the door and the shandy and the sandy car out of the way, pick up your demos and go. They will manage to get you out of your car from time to time, but take one of their cars, they're just as good for what you need to do. Don't race there though because you want to give yourself plenty of time for your health to regenerate. Especially if you're in the same condition I am going into this, which might well be, who knows, you might be uh, better at not being shot than I am. Now your targets are right inside, so you might want to drive down rather than walking down this, this car park runway. I always drive down here. One's on this floor, so deal with that one first. Alternatively, you could just die and then get. You know, it just happens sometimes. I can't hear to get. Um, Something that you guys need to know that I sort of haven't mentioned is I can't actually hear the game audio when I'm doing this, so I'm just literally going off what I can see on screen. So I'm one step down when it comes to doing this, that's why I'm dying a lot. Or at least that's the excuse I'm using. get upstairs so we want to try and find the staircase there are a lot of men with mis with submachine guns in here I am noticing that's a uh... ah, I'm on fire again The Sandy, the Sandy, the Sandy, I do think, are um, the one gang that has the most female members. I mean, there are quite a few female Ronin as well, I suppose, but... So how the fuck do I get up there, then? So yeah, I am walk oh there this is dead. Right, let's go up. He can't open that door. So let's just turn the uh, turn the heat off. Someone left the air. There we go. I think that's it, right? Oh, there's one more location to go to. Just make our way over there now. Look at this nice shiny sandy car they kept. They left for me. Part. Oh no. Okay, there's another one behind me. So we just run to the surface. Switch over to handguns. Just because it's easier to run around when you're carrying them as opposed to 
A large, a large shotgun. Pretty sure this is the one where I'm going to need a car, so... Oh, you know, I know the coppers are bashing around the head. I'm only doing... I'm only having a gang war. Don't know why it bother, bothers you. We're all bloody criminals, and if we all kill each other, then you don't have to do any bloody work, do you, Sergeant Lazy? Captain Obvious, so... We, if we kill, if we all kill each other off, you guys have less work to do. So I don't know why you're bitching so much. I'll take one of their cars since um, he was kind enough to put up, put park it right next to me with an inviting "Come and take me" sign. So now we've got their car, we can go and kill people. You could kill people with that, but it's easy to kill people when you're driving their own car. You don't have petrol in it or anything. It's awesome. <laughs> so this is our next target. I shot her in the bloom. Center. Right here, booting this door open. Better duck down. Died again. Oh well. <laughs> I know I look terrible with all the amount of deaths I'm doing, but things are really bit on the red. So what a cast up. Oh, you're doing it. Really? Excuse me, police officer. I've got to go. Thank you. Now then. If we go back here, run up there. Half the time you can just run past them. Because you do take a lot of bullet damage in this game, but. I'll right, pull the corner here. For a second, you can get down. They can't shoot me until they come around this corner, so... And the moment they do, I can shoot them, so... Stay low, it gives you an advantage. Mission target. It's on this floor, so I must have missed it. A bloody box. No, it isn't in the room just to the right. Okay. So now we've got the key to unlock the next door. Work our way to that door. Let's charge in. We can now open the door down here. So let's get low to give us an advantage against anyone who might be in here. Like you. And let's sidestep back through the door. Shoot you in the arms. Shoot you in the chest. Blow out that machine there. Chase down the one last dealer, so. I 
Let's take this blue car here and drive after him. I think I did hit him with a shotgun a couple of times. So. I love the uh, effect of the little haze that they put on your view in this mission because you've just been surrounded by drugs blowing up. So you would be a, you would be just a teensy bit high. You know, you've just been around a bunch of drugs burning because you've been burning tables and drug dealers deal dealing. So there is logic to the fact that you would be at this point. Pretty high. Still in range, mate. I'll take you, don't worry. I shot one of his tires, then, I think. So his, um, hand his handling is going to be fantastic right now. The fire engine seems interested in him as well. It's making it difficult for me that the fire engine wants to spray him with their hose. This car's gone. Let's to swipe him out. And that will do, won't it? That'll do for him. Let's say the general talk. Bonuses, we've got three grand, which is good. So, next time we'll do some more missions. Next time on Saints Row 2, we'll do some more missions. But for now, I bid you guys farewell. Make sure to like and subscribe. I know this isn't the best, the best quality of content, but it's better than no content, I think. So, thank you guys, and goodbye. Spent, so and, and bullets are very very much needed in this so you do definitely need to be armed. you can't be doing like I was in that mission in that veteran child kill mission relying on stealing other people's guns well I mean you can but it's so much easier knowing you can go in fully stocked up armed you know with more armed like Rambo you know and know that you're alright to do it rather than having to frugally pick bullets up off the floor like John McClane and Die Hard you know hey guys and welcome to another episode of Saints Row 2 more Sandy missions here because we want to take out the uh, lower dust gang first This is a, that is a very, very much, this is very much an in Let's park our Saints car there and walk. Time to kill people. Whoops, I let myself get blown to shit. That was a slight mistake, but hopefully the cutscene, the uh, hopefully the checkpoint will allow me to go back in. Do a bunch of drugs while we go and blow some people up. So let's um, arm ourselves with our, our newly stocked up machine guns. I'm going to go out and buy shepherd buy shepherd handguns uh, as soon as we make some money again. Because I spent all of our money on ammo because money seriously is very easy to come by in this game. 
you get like two or three thousand for a mission and um, you can just do one or two missions quickly just off camera and make up the money. joke that Shondi has thousands of X's. That's one of the um, in gags about this game that Shondi has hundreds of X's. Shondi's gonna, Shondi's gonna 